With LaunchBar, you can access anything on your Mac using just your keyboard, starting from applications and contacts to your entire music library or any other document. And you can then choose from a variety of actions to perform with the selected item. Now, to easily make your selection from this multitude of possibilities solely via keyboard, LaunchBar offers something called Adaptive Abbreviation Search. What this means is, to select an item, you simply enter a few characters that represent an abbreviation of the item's name. For example, to select the application named Text Edit, you can enter the word Text. Or you can enter the word Edit. Or even just the characters T and D. So you see, what abbreviation you personally feel fitting for an item can vary individually. The great thing about LaunchBar is that it will learn which abbreviation you prefer to use for which item. It will adapt. So the first time you use TE for text edit, the item may be way down in the list. If you actually use the item with this abbreviation, in this case, open the application, the second time you do the same, the item will already be closer to the top. And about the third time, it will be right on top of the list, waiting for you to just hit return to use it. It is also possible to specifically assign an abbreviation to a certain item. That way you can assign an abbreviation that may have nothing to do with the item's name. For example, if you like to refer to numbers via the letters SPRS for spreadsheet, simply locate Numbers in LaunchBar. Click on its icon or name in the bar to open the action menu and choose Assign Abbreviation. Now whenever you enter SPRS, numbers will be selected. So you can either let LaunchBar learn the abbreviations you use via Adaptive Abbreviation Search or you can directly assign specific abbreviations.